Hi, this is problem 18 from the AMC 12A. Let s of n equal the sum of the digits of a positive integer n. For a particular positive integer n, let the sum n equal 1274. Which of the following could be the value of the next sum n plus 1? Okay, for questions like this, I like to look at examples to better understand the question. And sometimes these examples can lead all the way to an answer. So let's try a few numbers to get a feel for this. Let's try a number say 127, and we go to the n plus 1 case, the units digit will increase by 1, and the tens and the hundreds digit will be unaffected. Now if we have a number that ends in a 9, and we go to the n plus 1 case, the units digit will decrease by 9, the tens will increase by 1, hundreds unaffected. We have two 9s, and we go to the n plus 1 case, we get these two digits decreasing by nine and the hundredths increasing by one. So I think I know what's going on here. Let's just try one more case. So we go to the n plus one case. These digits all drop by nine and the thousandth place increases by one. So I think I see what's going on here. When we go to the n plus one case, we take the sum of the n case we add 1, and we subtract a multiple of 9. So this looks like to be the key for uh, solving this problem, because we know that s of n plus 1 is just 1275. So we know that s of n plus 1 is 1275 minus m9, multiple of 9. So 1275 minus the n plus 1 case still has to be multiple of 9. So this looks like the test condition to check the possible answer choices. So let's just go through them. So for choice E, we have 1275 minus 1265, 10. That's not a multiple of 9. Choice D. That's uh, 36, that is a multiple of nine, so that is probably the correct answer. Now you may wanna check choices B, C, and A just to verify that they do not satisfy this case, and in all those cases you will find that they are not multiples of nine, so the answer is in fact choice D.